In 2021, Babcock International sponsored us to take moth watching and crafting kits into 20 Plymouth primary schools. On a Monday morning, I delivered one of these kits with a moth trap and crafting activity materials into the school and then collected them on the Friday afternoon. Hi, I'm Erin and moth to playing here to my school. Hi Erin, what did the moth trap look like? The moth trap first so it looks kind of plain and like a silver box with bits around it. The next day there was lots of moths, all types of different ones. They were so beautiful and pretty and so amazing. They were in amongst these egg boxes and we found this yellow underwing and in the forest we found a um, orange underwing. What other moths to a flame activities did you get up to? We coloured in moths and we brought them to life. It was very fun. Also we did a activity pack. The, there was a word search and there was an energy detective one that is really fun because if you just looked around you now and you might say the apples in the fruit bowl even are energy because we eat them and get energy from it. What, what would be your hope for the future? My hope for the future is that we have a plastic free world. My hope is for Plymouth to make more windmills. My hope is for Plymouth to put up more windmills. This is to make people turn off the lights when they're not in use. My hope is to have more, more renewable energy. My hope for the future is more solar power. I hope we can plant more trees in the future. Less trees. Promise is that I will turn off the light when I'm not using this. Is to plant ten trees after burning one. We estimate that 2,132 children were engaged through this particular part of the project. Never mind those children who then went on to use the activity sheets after the packs had been collected.